Hello, Yure. It's very nice to, to see you here and to, to talk with you. And uh, could you please uh, present yourself to our audience? Yeah, okay. So my name is Yuri Bishonsky. I'm a transpersonal psychologist and psychotherapist and a hypnotherapist. Uh, I've been doing this work for more than 30 years uh, in 70 country, uh, countries around the world. Uh, and I'll be very glad to come and share my experience uh, with you. Yeah, it's, it's very nice that you are coming here in Lithuania in August and uh, we will see you, we will meet you in our summer camp designated for women that it will be held in, in August from 18 to 21st. And uh, what are you going to do during our summer camp? What are you going to, I don't know, to, to present, to show, to teach? about what your activity is going to be. Okay. I'm going, I'm going mainly, not exactly to do a lecture, but to create an experience in which we can actually find out who we are, what is our real potential and what is our authentic self. Because in a way, during our lifetime, maybe starting from childhood and maybe through education, uh, we were actually programmed, okay, to adapt to certain structures and certain norms of behavior. Uh, what is our dream? What was our dream eventually when we were young? And when we left school, I wonder how much education has, pres has actually prepared us for life and how much life experience we had to choose what we really want to do. So we're looking for some kind of profession that will bring us money. So what happens next? We wake up in the morning and the reason we get out of be from bed is to go to work, to do a job, to earn money, to pay the bills. Because from very early childhood, we are programmed that we need to look for security, and stability in life. What does it mean stability? It means we need to get fixated because if you start something, you need to finish. You need to do it to death, even if you don't like it. I never rem uh, forget my first day in school. This, my education started this way. There was a teacher with the finger. The studies are very difficult. A lot of children fail. You have to work hard. If you don't work hard, you're going to fail. And this was my preparation for education. So I've learned a few things that most of them were totally useless for life, for creating relationships, for uh, presenting myself in a positive way. I got stressed to fulfill the needs and the expectation of the society I'm living in. What is our real mission and passion? I would say, what is our real passion and mission? What do we really want to do? And this is actually one of the aspects of transpersonal psychology, which is, which is the psychology that goes beyond the ego, that goes to the spiritual world and touch our soul. What we want to do. The world out there is not a nice world. It's full of challenges and it's not getting any better. We're raising children. One day we're going to send them out to this world. How do we sleep at night knowing that our children will go out there? What are we going to do about it? So the first thing we need to do about it is to look inside ourselves and find our real authentic self. And by example, show our children that we can all have a better life. When we talk about children, it doesn't matter how old they are. Our parents are still our role models. Even after they die and pass to the other side peacefully, they're still our role models. 
we need to find ourselves. We need to find what we want to do. Because stability, everything is changing. The weather is changing. When I cross the river, the river is not the same river anymore. We cannot cross the same river twice. When I go to sleep at night, when I wake up in the morning, I am a completely different person. On a physiological level, my cells are pressing them, themselves all the time. Ph physiologically, we change. But sometimes mentally and emotionally, we get fixated on the ideas that our computer here was programmed by society. It's important to find out where I'm coming from, where am I now, and only then decide where I'm going to. What is the gift that I want to give to humanity? What do I want to contribute to the world? We lock ourselves in our nice houses, we lock the door, we close the gate, we put the alarm system on, and we live in a secure, nice, stable place. How do we sleep at night when we know our children one day we leave home and go out there? What are we going to do about it? As personally and as a collective. So the whole idea of this seminar is not about giving lectures, but actually having an experience, experiencing ourselves through role, role play, through constellation, through uh, drama therapy, real authentic self. It's not about changing. It's about accepting who I am. There's nothing to change. So in my opinion, and it might be wrong, all our so-called problems are just a normal, re a normal reaction to an abnormal situation they created by our imagination and the best way to imagine things is by closing our eyes and go on a journey inside ourselves to touch this authentic little self this child that was born free this child that were unhappy screamed and when happy they laughed this real free child that we actually have abandoned but trying to be serious, responsible individual, responsible for others, but not responsible for ourselves. Yeah. So during our uh, during our camp, we actually will be looking for for ourselves that is already in 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 us inside. Yeah. We, we have the the things in in our side, and. Um, as you already mentioned, uh, that uh, all the activity during our camp will be based on uh, experience. And you already mentioned about uh, transpersonal psychology, you already mentioned about hypnotherapy, and there will be as well uh, uh, professionals who are, let's say, will provide us with forest bathing and uh, body and movement therapy, and we will yeah. be having uh, fairy tales, and mm -hmm. we will be having uh, bibliotherapy practices. So we will be doing a lot of different uh, practices based on our personal experiences, and yeah. we will be experiencing everything. Yes, absolutely. You see, if something breaks in my house and I need to repair it, if I open my toolbox and I find only one screwdriver, my chances to fix it are very poor. We need to explore all the subject through a lot of different aspects and tools. What I'm providing, what I'm giving, what I'm offering is not the answer to everything. On a holistic level, we're going to explore everything. Mm -hmm. so do you have something about nutrition? Mm, you mean during our stock, some, yeah. our camp? Yeah. Uh, maybe there will come something about nutrition. And yeah. uh, I, I guess 
Yuri, you know, I guess we touch intuition. One of the methods to, to touch intuition is metaphoric cards, and we will be do, using metaphoric cards uh, during our camp. I'm also talking about nutrition. Food. Ah, nutrition. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah. I am. Yeah, I am what I eat and drink. Yeah, yeah. It's also yeah. part of me. Yeah. Sorry, I'm I'm misunderstood you, but yeah, what is okay. rega yeah. regarding uh, what is regarding nutrition? We'll be having very good food that it will be prepared specially for us, homemade and vegetarian. Yeah. So we will be having a good place. We will be having good nature, wild nature by by the wild uh, river. We'll be having uh, professional lectures, and we will be having a nice, nice group. Yeah, yeah. Because you see, the important thing for me is doing things rather than talking about mm -hmm. them. Okay, knowledge is important. You know, I I always use the metaphor of a car. Okay, the car to run needs petrol, <clears throat> but what runs the car is the engine. Mm. Petrol is the knowledge we have in our head. The engine is our heart. Is actually start doing things on a heart level. Yeah. You see, we are this kind of intellectual society trying to understand everything. There's nothing to understand. So I'm not going to fall in love until I'm not going to understand logically <laughs> what love is. Love is the most illogical thing. What there is to understand. Yeah. I'm actually very excited about coming, meeting yeah? new people. Yeah. Oh, very mm -hmm. nice. Is, yeah. is that going to be the first time you are in Lithuania or you already no, been no. here? I, I was there before. There was some one or two conferences that I've attended. Mm. Okay, then uh, we will be waiting for you in, in our summer camp to come and uh, uh, the, the name of our sum, summer camp is very symbolic, uh, life as a flow. And yeah. uh, let's say for me, the, the idea of the camp, the mission of the camp, to find in ourselves inside the, the flow and to make it uh, to flow fluently. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think it's the most important thing in, in life to, to have... Uh, okay our inner energy to, to go fluently. So, Yura, we will be waiting you and see you in August. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank it you. It was very nice to see you. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> see you. Bye.